So um, now I'm 70 miles outside of Las Vegas, New Mexico, getting beat up pretty good in these in this turbulence. And part of the problem with that is that although I'm at 12,500 feet, I'm only 5,000 feet above the ground. And I don't know if you can see it, but off the wingtip there is a whole row of uh, snow-capped mountains. Yet here is pretty much uh, desert, although I can begin to see snow-capped mountains in front of me. And uh, the ground underneath here is pretty rough now. It's foothills and dry washes and things like that. There's scrubby growth there. Not flat anymore like it was about 50 miles back. So this is absolutely one of the weirder places I've ever been. This is the uh, airport at Las Vegas, New Mexico. It's about 5.30 in the afternoon. There's mountains over there. They got snow on them. And the rest of this place is just, I don't know what to call it. It's, everything's burned, everything's the same color. I couldn't even see the airport till I was on top of it. Then I got here a quarter to five, it's supposed to be open till five. Nobody's here, locked up tight as a drum, can't even get into a bathroom. Um, fortunately, they have uh, pump it yourself fuel. And I managed to get that going, although it took a half an hour because the thing pumped so slow. But anyway, I'm going to get back in the plane and head toward uh, Albuquerque. I should be able to get there before. And oh yeah, I almost forgot. They actually have tumbleweed blowing across the uh, runway. Boy, this place is really uh, godforsaken. I kid you not, there is tumbleweed blowing across the place. There's the uh, altimeter. We're at almost 7,000 feet. I do have to lean the mixture or I'm not getting full power. There's just nobody here. There's a VOR on the field, believe it or not. There it is. Kind of strange, but time for me to take off.